Tesla Cam. I hope you're satisfied. This submitter had parked outside of a restaurant in Bel Air, Texas, just outside of Houston. When he got back to his car, he found this Sentry Mode event of a Honda that had pulled up next to him. Out comes a man who is clearly checking out the Model Y, but he couldn't have imagined what would happen next. The man got in front of the Tesla and, once in clear view of the front cameras, he held up a laminated sheet that said, I love your Tesla. We liked this video so much, we posted it on Twitter when it was first sent to us a few weeks ago, and the tweet went viral among the Tesla Twitter community. As a result, we actually found the man with the sign. His name is Blake Linton, and he describes himself as a 57-year-old boomer, native Houstonian, Tesla shareholder, and huge fan of Elon, Tesla, and SpaceX. He was motivated by the Sentry Mode videos we've all seen of people committing senseless acts of hate against Teslas, and he wanted to counter those with an expression of love. Blake is patiently waiting for the delivery of his Cybertruck as he has one of the first reservations. We can't wait to see what happens when you put a Honda driver behind the wheel of a Cybertruck. The Cybertruck bumps are going to be epic. Blake, you're this week's real MVP. This lady thought she had put her car in park, but she must have left it in neutral instead. When the car in front of her left, her car started rolling towards Steve's parked Model Y. Let's cue up the dramatic music and tell the Honda to release the car. Steve filed an insurance claim and adds that he's hoping it doesn't take two months to get it repaired. Sean was driving in Kingsport, Tennessee when a turkey came flying out low and became the victim of a Honda bump. The turkey seemed to be okay and was sitting in the opposite lane for a bit before Sean believes it flew off. He hit the Tesla Cam save button a bit too early to capture the bird in the side cameras. Sean stayed and offered the Tesla Cam footage to the driver of the Honda. A few minutes later, the police arrived to talk to the Honda driver, but they declined a copy of the footage. Flavian had just gotten his Model 3 only three days prior to this event, and this was his first time he left the car in a public parking lot. He made sure to activate sentry mode, and he wasn't disappointed by what it recorded. A stranger got out of his car and started taking pictures of the Tesla. Next, he asked for help from someone else so he could be in a picture with the Tesla. We're sure the pictures turned out great. Aiden had parked his Model 3 on the streets of Florence, Italy. He was visiting a friend's apartment, but sentry mode and some cats were watching his car. We can see a guy walking a bike down the street. He crosses the street and walks by the Tesla, glancing inside the windows. At first, it looks like he was just minding his own business when he keeps walking down the street. When we see him turn around and approach the Tesla again, he doesn't just look inside the windows, he smashes one of them. Aiden got a notification on his phone, so he quickly ran downstairs and, upon seeing the damage, he was shocked. The thief had stolen a backpack, holding an iPhone 8 Plus, and a wallet containing 200 euros in cash. Aiden contacted the police, but they couldn't identify the thief. He got charged 800 euros for the rear window replacement, or about 950 US dollars. Aiden sent us a copy of the video with the thief's face blurred out, which we suspect is an Italian legal requirement. We wouldn't want to get sued by a thief after all, or the European Commission. 
Derek was driving his Model 3 late at night in China. He was heading to a supercharger when he saw a car driving the wrong way nearly smash into a bus. Then it kept on trucking still in the wrong direction. He couldn't see its license plate number, so there wasn't any way for him to report the incident. Thankfully, nobody was hurt. Brayden's dog, Sniff, is super protective of his family, and anytime they leave the house, Sniff comes outside to protect them on their way out. They live on a private drive and raise cattle. Sniff always does his best to keep them safe from the evil cows and tries to scare them away from the fence. Brian was going home from work in his Model 3 in Kelseyville, California when traffic started moving slowly due to construction. He kept a close eye in his rearview mirror as he was afraid of being rear-ended. That's when he saw a gray Ford sedan pop out into oncoming traffic. Brian immediately accelerated to the side and the SUV behind him pulled off to the side as well. They both jumped out to check on the people involved in the accident. When Brian got out of his car, he called 911 and emergency services were on the scene within five minutes. By the looks of the aftermath, the Kia driver wasn't paying attention and slammed into the gray Ford sedan, causing her to bump into a Toyota pickup ahead of her. After the dust had settled, the Ford driver was advised to go to the hospital due to some neck and head pain. The other drivers were able to drive away. The CHP officer requested Brian's info and asked to see the footage that his Tesla had recorded. After seeing that the video didn't capture the actual impact, the officer decided he didn't need a copy of it. Brian added that the officer had no idea on how to get into the Tesla. In fact, he didn't even want to sit in the passenger seat. His reason was that it was too fancy for him, which gave Brian a good laugh. Marco was driving his Model 3 on a major highway in Mexico when he was passed by two motorcycles. On the first one, there were three people with one little girl standing on the bike. The next one apparently didn't have a functional front wheel. Now that's pretty crazy. One other thing we noticed was Blake's hat that says Occupy Mars. Speaking of occupying Mars, Sentry Mode on Lane's Model 3 was triggered in South Padre Island, Texas by the sonic boom from the SN10 launch as Elon Musk makes progress on his mission to occupy Mars. That's a beautiful sight. We usually end our videos with fireworks when we thank our Patreon supporters, but we have one more video for you before we wrap things up. While Ron and his family were driving their Model 3 one night in Denver, Colorado, they saw a meteor just out of the corner of their eyes. Luckily, they thought to quickly press the Tesla Cam save button, and they couldn't wait to share it with Wham Bam Tesla Cam. Ron says that they love the channel and watch every episode as soon as it comes out. Thanks, Ron. He also said that he too wishes to have a Cybertruck someday. We're not sure if he's serious or if he's just sick of the Cybertruck song. Oh well, here it is again. Oh Lord, won't you buy me a cyber truck? My friends I'll drive diesel, I must make amends.